In 2015, there were 6,350 hectares grown, approximately. 5,700 hectares of that was ryegrass. Um, in the UK, all production has to be certified, by which, it, which means that it has to meet field standards um, for contamination and also isolation from other crops. And also, obviously, once it's harvested, it has to meet, field stand it has to meet standards in the lab. Um, most crops are grown for two years, uh, except Italian ryegrass, which is only grown for one year. Um, the general trend since the 1980s and 1990s has been for a reduction in the area in the UK, but since 2010 uh, the area has been increasing again. Most grass seed grown here is uh, uh, ryegrasses, um, and the per mainly perennial ryegrasses which are split into diploid and tetraploid types. There is also hybrid ryegrasses which are a cross between an Italian and a perennial. But we should also consider that there is a significant area of fescue grasses and bent grasses, mainly for um, amenity production. Grass seed makes a very good break crop um, and makes a, a, a change in a, in a farmer's rotation from crops like peas or beans or oilseed rape. Um, and in the last few years, there's been a, a, an improvement in seed yields from grass seeds. Um, based on work that breeders do, but also improvements in um, agronomy and the way the crop's actually farmed. Um, with attention to detail, the grass seed crop can actually be the best gross margin crop um, a farm can produce, um, the best combinable crop anyway. So, um, uh, you know, many farmers who have been doing it for, for a long time have stuck at it and perfected the technique of growing it. Um, growing a two-year break because it is down for two years is also an extremely good way of increasing soil organic matter and uh, the organic matter of the soil is a, is a, a very topical subject at the moment because um, it, increasing the soil organic matter improves soil moisture retention and also the um, uh, retention of nutrients which um, is, is important. Um, also, we've discovered that uh, the two-year break will help with control of black grass, which is also another hot topic in ar arable agriculture at the moment. And it gives a farmer an opportunity of growing a, a seed crop of cereals or something else after the two-year break that the grass seed gives. Like a lot of uh, other crops, we're, we're struggling with retaining uh, chemicals for, that we can use on the crop to particularly herbicides for weed control and um, it, it's becoming an increasing problem but fortunately there is a, a good infrastructure in the industry right through from the breeders to the growers to the agronomists to the merchants which uh, we're all working to make sure that UK production is maintained to the highest standards possible and from that infrastructure we've got trials programs going on and um, there's also a big exchange of knowledge with our colleagues in other parts of the world where they they have a, perhaps a bigger industry and have more access to information. But that's very important as well. So there is further information on the G-Source website.